It's your boy High Five Vega back again with a quick video. This is just going to be Black Friday deals that I think you might be interested in. So I've picked out nine or 10 deals that I think are pretty good value. If you know of some Black Friday deals that I don't include on this list, definitely leave them in the comments below so all your fellow base heads and audio nerds can check them out as well. So let's just jump straight into the list. So one of my first picks is the Rockford Fosgate T2500 refurbished on Amazon. You can get it right now for $975, which I think is a steal of a deal for this beast of an amp. Now, you might think that's not a lot of power for $1,000. And, you know, comparatively to some other amps, it is not. But in my opinion, these Rockford amps are kind of in a league on their own. They're very high quality amps and people who have experience with them can definitely tell you the same thing that I'm saying right here. So if you're in the market for a big Rockford amp, this is the biggest one they make currently and you can get it under $1,000, not too bad of a deal. My next pick is the Pioneer D9701. Now I reviewed this back in late 2020 and it was going for around $150, $160. It then jumped up to way over $300, which in my opinion, definitely don't purchase it at that price. But the price is down again. We're at $185. And you can see right here, last purchase in February of 2020. So I have purchased this and used this amp myself for you know quite a while and i think it's a very solid amp for 185 dollars it's rated truly and in my opinion it's a good budget subwoofer amp it's one that a lot of people don't talk about but i definitely think it's worth your time all right for my last pick on amazon i'm going with a circle jig if you have a router this is essential if you're building box this is an essential tool for a long time you can only get these from one company because they had the patent on them the patent is up now you can get them cheap just about anywhere so this one right here at twenty dollars is one of the cheaper ones that you can find and it's the same plastic construction that you would have got in the other model i think this one's a solid buy for 20 bucks definitely going to help you get your circles right this is another one of those stocking stuffer type gifts you can get for the car audio enthusiast especially one that likes to get out in the workshop. Now we're gonna move on to amplifiers and let's start with the MVX MVP6. I just reviewed the four channel model of this. It exceeded all its ratings. It's a great little amp, but today I'm showing you the six channel model because I think it's awesome to have six 100 watt channels for your speakers, for your mid bass, any way you wanna do it. If you wanna run a active front stage and rear fill, you have six channels to do that. If you wanna run a three way front stage where you have 100 watts for your mid bass, 100 watts for your mids, and 100 watts for your tweeters, you can do that all for $300. And with the NVX products on the NVX website, you can use the coupon code high 5 vega 10 to get 10% off your order. The next product I'm gonna show you is the NVX XAD13, the 2000 watt full bridge amplifier. Now I did a video on this just last year, definitely did overrated. And uh, I think it done somewhere to the tune of 2,500 watts, maybe even 2,800 watts. I'll have to link that video so you guys can check it out. It's actually a fairly efficient amp as well. And it's compact. It's nine inches by six and a half inches by two and a half inches high at $213. If you use coupon code, high five vega 10 you can get even more off that i think it's well worth looking at if you want a lot of power in that 200 dollars range this is probably going to be a good amp for you to check out now the final nvx thing that i want to show you is the sound deadening so i use the silver version of the sound deadening in several builds it's always a very good value and this one in particular is actually a little bit thicker than what they did before this is 90 mil versus the 80 mil that they had before so you get a little extra thickness you get the black you get 40 square foot that's considered the trunk size kit at 110 dollars you definitely want to consider sound dampening when you're doing an install because it's the easiest time to do it it's going to give you the biggest bang for your buck as far as sound quality in my opinion and you're going to get rid of some of those nasty rattles that you might otherwise have and kind of kill the sound of the speakers you just bought all right now we're jumping into some big boy stuff so i'm going to recommend the sundown X series 18 It's currently $120 off normal price. And as you can see, this thing is an absolute monster. And at that 18 inch size, it's just gonna be an absolute brute. 
and you might as well get it while it's on sale if you're thinking about one of these anyways. And last but certainly not least is all the JP amps. They're all on sale right now. Let's scroll through and I'll show you the ones that I'm interested in. Down for sound, JP8 version 1.5. This thing did over 1200 watts. It's compact at $170 with the cool bass knob, with the performance, with the looks of it. It's really hard to beat. It's a nice little amp for most people that are getting into car audio. Right beside the JP88 is the JP77. Now this amplifier is seven channels and it is an absolute monster. So let's check out the ratings here. This thing is rated 120 watts by six and 1000 watts by one. And if you start loading it down, you get 190 watts by six at two ohms. 1600 watts by one at two ohms and then if you bridge the sub channel all the way down you get 2000 watts in my opinion if you're going to buy a multi-channel amp this year and you're the kind of person that likes a lot of power like most of us do under 600 dollars, this amp is going to be hard to beat so you might want to grab it when it's on sale this is definitely the most intriguing amp to me out of all the JP amps, just because the versatility of it. And of course, if you need a bunch of power, they got you covered there. They have the 33, the 43, the 63, the 83. All of them are well underrated and certainly over deliver on everything. I think they're at a very fair price, especially if you catch them on sale. So if you have been considering one of these JP amps, the time to buy is now. I will leave affiliate links and store links in the description below and in the comments so you guys can check any of these out if you want to. That being said, what deals have you found? Put those in the comments below. I wanna see what deals I might've missed, what deals you guys think are absolutely stellar deals that everybody should be checking out. So that's it for my video. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope you have a very happy Thanksgiving, spend time with your family, watch some football. You know, after the football games are over, you can watch some more High Five Vega videos if you want. But that being said, I hope to catch every single one of you on the next video. I appreciate all of my patrons, but the $6 or more members get a special shout out. That is 2001 Monolithic, Gene Nava, Joaquin Juarez, El Fuego Audio, Travis McClendon, Brandon Hanna, William Burke, Fox Boy Audio, Sound Solutions, Jesus Tires, Dennis Cromwell Jr., Scott Dielbeck, D. Stewart, David Coslick, Scott McCord, Matthew Tolbert, Colin Nutt, Trucker 9000, James Childers, Baba, Thomas Marshall, Living Loud with Andy, and Neil Nato. For as little as $2 a month, you can join the team and get access to an exclusive Patreon-only Hangout stream. It's a blast. You guys really should check it out. And if you're thinking about it, check me out at patreon.com slash high five Vega.